For those of you who don't know who James True is, he's a streamer on YouTube who's fairly popular. James True is someone that I've been watching his content for quite some time, and over that period of time, I've grown to care about him. And I've been praying for his salvation. For a little over a year now, I've been making small appeals via Super Chats and in his comment section, you know, speaking to his conscience about the Lord. Um, to James and how he perceives me is nothing more than just a past, an arrogant one. Um, there's no way that you can judge sincerity online. And I can relate with James in a lot of ways because if someone was professing the name of Jesus to me three or four years ago, I would have an almost identical reaction. I viewed Christians as people who thought they were better than me, that knew all the answers, and um, I, can, I can see how I would incite that reaction from him. Um, nevertheless, there's no one that's out of God's reach. If someone as prideful and arrogant as myself can come to know the truth and be set free by it, James True can also. Um, it would make me happy to not only see him in heaven, but I can't help but to think how much of an asset James True would be for the kingdom of God. To be a focal point in a community full of spiritual strongholds, um, to profess the name Jesus and say Christ is Lord would be truly um, amazing. James will never see this video. I'm just a nobody on YouTube, but I know that the Lord, the one who sits upon that throne, hears the supplications of his children. And if you were to stumble upon this video um, out of the kindness of your heart and for the love of another person's soul, could you also um, pray for James? Um, a short prayer for James goes a long way.